Hello and welcome to Prop Tiger's Right to Home online event where we will connect prospective home buyers with reputed developers and their top projects across the country. I'm your host Neha Sharan and to help you pick the best property options in Gurgaon, we have with us Mr. Tarun from Anantraj. Welcome. He will answer some of the most pertinent queries related to Anantraj projects in Gurgaon. I also welcome Mr. Deepak Dureja, who is the city head and property expert in the Delhi NCR market. Warm welcome, Tarun and Thank Deepak. You, Hi, Tarun. Thank you, now, before we step into the webinar, let's set the tone of this webinar with a project video. Can we have the project video, please? for introducing Maceo. We would also quickly see a presentation in a while. But before that, let me come to you, Tarun. I want to ask you a question about the project. Now, which segment of property is the most popular in the Gurgaon market? Uh, Deepak, you can also answer this. I would want to understand the popular price bracket, whether affordable is good, luxury is good. What configuration are people going in for? Can you both throw lights? Uh, see, Sneha, the if you're talking about the which properties is good, so it's a ready to move property is more demanding in the market right now. It either is a affordable housing, either is a luxury housing. So basically the buyer is demanding, they are looking, searching and hunting the property, the ready to move in properties. Okay. Who were who taking the position in a month or two months or immediately. Okay. Deepak, what have, what trends have you seen in the market? Neha, I think uh, Tarun has rightly said that right now, uh, uh, you know, during all these COVID times and in the last one year mm -hmm. especially, uh, the demand has really gone up. Demand has definitely surged upon uh, for uh, for the ready to move in properties. Okay. And okay. Uh, when you talk about the price range, so uh, so anything in the range, if, when you talk about Gurgaon, so anything in the range of 80 lakh rupees to 1 CR, 1.1 CR has been a sweet spot. So the demand has been very high. Now, again, uh, it depends upon location also, but uh, this has been a sweet spot. So when you go to Golf Course Extension Road, there obviously the price uh, are are higher. But 80 lakh, anything mm -hmm. within the range of uh, 70, 80 lakh rupees to 1.1, 1.2 CR has been a sweet spot, and a lot of transactions have happened in this price range. All right. Moving on to my next question. Now, if we talk of the, about the digital shift in property buying on a scale of 1 to 10, how do you rate the sector in Gurgaon and your company? Tarun. If, uh, if you want to get the rating of this property, so I can rate the 8 to 10 points. Okay. Do you, yeah. do you think uh, Gurgaon or buyers are ready for a digital shift? Are they looking for properties online? Have you seen any change? over the past one or two years? Yes, exactly. The most of the people's right now, the, as per the last question and you, the Mr. Dureja has given the answer to the COVID time. The, especially mm -hmm. in the COVID times, the, uh, the people have not come over here and they're looking the property on the physically. They come over there in the, uh, through the medium of the digital. They are searching the property on the various portals like Magic, mm -hmm. Housings, 99 oh. Birds. And they are looking a property uh, through the drone shoots. They are looking a property on the web, looking a property in the web uh, webinar also. So the properties uh, buyings are increased uh, through these uh, digital upscales. All right. We're keen to understand the USP of this project, Maceo. Tarun, would you guide us, please? After which we can begin with the presentation.
Hello. Yeah. It's all good. Yes, yes, you're audible, Tarun. See, the Maceo main USP is uh, the configuration of the two, three bedroom apartment with the duple penthouses and with the lush of greens. And the lot of the amenities are open here and the three sided open apartments. In terms of the amenities, we are providing the jogging track, mini soccer field for kids, tennis court, has basketball court, open gym, club area, and waiting lounge. Uh, these kind of amenities we are providing them issue. Great, thank you. Uh, can we have the presentation now? Yeah, Tarun, can you please explain this uh, presentation a little? Sure. Can you uh, back the pages, please? Okay. Uh, can you next page? Again, next. Uh, basically, this is a sector plan of the uh, surrounding the Maceo. Maceo is located at sector 91, which is well connected with the upcoming Dwarka Expressway as well as the National Highway 8 also. So Dwarka Expressway distance is hardly 1.5 km from there, from the Maceo. And the NH8 is, uh, you can say that 3.5 km from the Maceo. <clears throat> Next, this is a aerial view. Basically, this is a site layout plan of this uh, Maceo, which is spread on the 16 acres. We have a 16 tower in the Maceo, in the configuration of the two, three, four bedroom apartments. Uh, if you look at this J, K, L, M, N for the two bedroom apartments, and A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H for the three bedroom wing, and uh, P, Q, R, H for the four bedroom wing. The sizes starts onwards from the 1310, it, it goes up to 5,000 square feet. I'm just skip that. We have uh, some penthouses also. In JKLMN, the two bedroom wing, we have a uh, two sizes is 1310 and 1404. And A to H, we have a uh, two variants is three bedroom and three bedroom plus study plus servant. And along with the uh, duple penthouses on the top area, the penthouses sizes are uh, starting on verse 3200 for the three bedroom. And another is 4200 is also for the three bedroom apartment. PKOR is for the uh, four bedroom wing, and we have a penthouses in PKOR also, which is uh, sizes 5,000 square foot area. And a part of that, we have the all of the amenities which are working. These are the active amenities like sitting gazebos, wooden deck, open amphitheater, uh, jogging track, half basketball court, skating ring, soccer field, center court, water body, reflexology point, preschool facilities, running tracks. These are the active facilities in the Maceo. Uh, next, this is a configuration of the two bedroom apartment. So the size is 1310, which we have already discussed. Uh, this is the layout with living, dining and the two bedrooms and with the three balconies. Another we have a second option in the two bedroom is 1404. It's two bedroom plus two toilets and the four balconies. Uh, this is a three bedroom size is uh, 1862, uh, which is the three bedroom and three toilets. We have a, uh, one of the upper variants in the three bedroom is 2320. It's three bedroom plus study plus servant. This is a living dining with, uh, connected with the servant room. Uh, either your utility is one of the uh, study at here and the three bedrooms.
This is a PQR is a four bedroom layout. <coughs> this is an inter foyer. Uh, this is a servant. This is a living dining area. This is a first guest room. And another three uh, left uh, rooms are over here. Three bedrooms. Uh, this is the specification sheet which are uh, which we are providing in the flat. Uh, this is a club facade, and in this club we are providing the amenities like toddlers areas and uh, uh, gym, yoga zone. And uh, family lounge, rooftop swimming pool, etc. This is services which will be providing in the pre-school daycare facilities, grocery stores, shuttle services, multi-level security check, facilities management services. We had already facilities management which is uh, done by the GLL. It's already in the in our uh, complex, and 300 plus families already move in this society. Out of 788 apartments, thank you, Tarun. Welcome. So uh, let me come back to another question. Now, who is your target audience for Maceo and what is the age group of this uh, target audience? Uh, we are uh, targeting the Maceo audiences. The Maceo customer is basically who's working in the IMT Manesar and the DLF uh, cyber city areas. Who's working mm -hmm. in the uh, in this areas? Which they're already moving this uh, Maceo. They're already okay. residing that. All right. Uh, Deepak, the last question for the session now. Now, for buyers who are interested to buy but are skeptical skeptical about making a purchase, what is your advice? Um, I, I I have a very simple advice for them. Uh, so, if you're a buyer, you should not be skeptical. Mm -hmm. If you're really a serious buyer, there is no point you being skeptical. Huh. What is important is to look for right partner to search your property and to look for right developer who has a good product and who has got who has got good track of it. So I guess uh, as far as, uh, uh, you know, your search partner is concerned, so Prop Tiger is there to take care of that thing. And as far as good developer is concerned, so we have got a, a company which is well listed in stock market, you know, Anand Raj uh, is always there. And uh, they have got a very nice project which is already delivered in New Gurgaon. And, uh, and, and this, this project is worth visiting once if you are really looking to buy something for yourself. In a very good price range, uh, three bedroom, four bedroom, bedroom apartments are there, and and I think they are not left with much of the inventory also. So this is the time mm -hmm. you should just come out of your house, raise your queries, and uh, you know the Prop Tiger team will get in touch with you immediately, and will help you visiting the site. Whether you want to do a physical visit or you want to do a virtual visit, in both ways it will help you, and will ensure you'll get the best of the deal, and and you have your uh, you know dream home with you. And do not have any you know, uh, skeptical, skeptical uh, on your mind. Be sure and it will help you bring you something very good. Thank you. Thank you, Deepak. Thank you, Tarun, for being with us today and answering the queries. We'll be coming up with more such interactions so that we're able to help out our customers to make informed decisions. Stay safe, stay healthy. Goodbye. Thank you. Okay. Thank you.